The end of the Cretaceous period is one of the most famous parts of the geologic record. 66 million years ago, nearly all of that diversity disappeared. 75% of species vanished, including nearly all of the dinosaurs. In places all around the world, there's an actual line of sediment that marks this event. You can actually touch it with your hands. For a long time, this was a huge scientific mystery. Once again, a mass extinction doesn't happen for no reason. Paleontologists knew that something had completely destroyed global ecosystems, but they didn't know what. There were lots of hypotheses, but no solid answers. In the 1980s, a team of scientists identified high concentrations of the chemical iridium in those end Cretaceous layers all around the world. They also found shocked minerals which are minerals that have been subjected to incredible heat and pressure. We find minerals like that at nuclear testing sites. Both iridium and shocked minerals are potential side effects of an asteroid impact. At the time, lots of other scientists thought the idea of an asteroid causing a mass extinction was far-fetched, especially without more evidence to support it. But it wasn't long before they found the crater. Seismic scanning and underground drilling in the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico revealed a giant bowl-shaped feature buried deep beneath the surface. It has all of the features of an impact crater, and it's about 120 miles across. Based on the size of the crater, geologists estimate it was made by an asteroid at least six miles wide. And this crater sits in the geologic record at exactly the end of the Cretaceous period. How's that for more evidence? <laughs> 